We're here in Sydney with a Melbourneite, George Cabagnari's very well-known comedian. Okay, so going to Athens, then you could actually be really silly. You could do things that you wouldn't normally do I here. Could. I could. What would yeah. you have done if you were there now? Something yeah. silly that. Mm, well, some dumb. I did one Australian dumb thing because people told me if you if you go to the Acropolis again, the Acropolis. Um, you can get away with if paying you, the Greek price. If you were to go to the Acropolis now? Yeah, the Acropolis Sorry, now. I had to say that. <laughs> uh, it's back on TV, Acropolis now. Did really? you know that? It's no. on the History Channel. Um, so, buy the box set from me. Um, well, you can do that. When you come and see my show, whichever one you're going to see. Do you know I'm doing a show? Did I no, tell you? no. I'm doing a brand new show. Here in Sydney, I'm doing a show. Uh, we're excited. Yeah, Canterbury uh, Leagues, the Bulldogs. Uh, it's my one man show called 54 Night Out, so it's a brand new show. 54 so Night Out? I called it 54 Night Out because my dad died when he was 54, and now I'm 54. Oh. So this is going to be a very funny year for me. He's old. Old, like him. <laughs> Hopefully, I'll live through it. Um, and uh, the other show I'm doing that I'm very excited, excited so, so about. So, what's that about? What's that 54? 54 Night Out. Night Out. So it's a comedy about me, George, where I'm at okay. at the moment. So Does it um, talk about your childhood? Does it talk, talk about childhood, talk about my dad passing away when he was 54, talk about you know going to the gym, trying to get healthy, all that stuff. Midlife. It's George at his midlife crisis. Okay, that's, that's, that could that's be why I'm wearing very, very a daddy hat. Okay, so uh, that's that Looking show. Looking forward to that. So that's going to be good. Uh, I'm so also that's, doing so they, that's, you're in Canterbury? Canterbury Leagues, Canterbury 18th Southern? of March. 18th of March. And then the other show I'm doing, which uh, we've already started, we've done two shows, and it's got, gotten a great response. We, in fact, we just got a review, 9 out of 10 stars. So uh, that's a show called uh, Straight Outta Compo, which is me, Joel Vardy, uh, Rob Shahadi, and Tahir from the Hubbibis as well. So okay, that's so an awesome show. Straight Outta Compo. Straight Outta Compo. Relating to do two different topics or? Straight out of Compton, you know the movie Straight Out of Compton? Yes. So it's 80s and 90s rap music meets dodgy wogs on compo. <laughs> that, that's going to be hilarious. So I can't say anymore, but Looking it's pretty hilarious. It. Yeah, it's very funny. Yeah. People give you advice about going to Greece and they go, when you go to the Acropolis, okay, make sure you ask for the Greek price. Because they'll give it to you because you're a Greek won't have any problem just walk up there and go how much is it and I'll give you a price and they go now la piene linikiti me and they'll give you the Greek price which well, is like look, half price. Look George here they give this little card when you go and you buy a coffee and they click a hole in it click a hole yeah. and then you end up getting your well when you're Greek and yeah. they're so proud to be Greek it's like you know what I'm gonna give you a discount. But guess what I didn't get the discount. <laughs> Told me to piss off. <laughs> he chased me down. Why? What did you do? <laughs> I don't know. I said, can I have the Elinikiti me? He goes, I'm not to get out of Sofia, brother. So that's bullshit. Don't believe anybody that says that. Scatta, na fane. No, so what you need to say is, Posehi, o cafes, and they'll say, in a triagro, Ekite mia kalitere timi, ya ina nele na sakimena. Vivis Maybe if you're a hot chick like yeah, you, but yeah. me, forget no. it. Well, I think that forget kind it. of lost it. <laughs> okay, what about a soup like you? What's the No, that's not what I would do. Maybe in Mykonos I would have gotten half price. You, you see? Yeah. 